Our nation has seen its share of weather-related catastrophic events and man-made terrors lately. And one local preparedness center wants to make sure that enforcement, emergency, and health care service agencies nationwide are ready for all sorts of possible disastrous incidents. The Center for Domestic Preparedness in Anniston welcomed members of the Baltimore Regional Incident Management Team to its training center in Anniston this week. The group is preparing for the upcoming All-Star Game that will be in Baltimore at Camden Yards. The week-long training culminated with a full hazard comprehensive training event. Fire and rescue personnel, police personnel, and emergency health care leadership learned how to deal with mass casualty and suspect searches in a realistic way. Anytime you have people involved, you you know, they could have various sources of, of hazards that they're going to have to deal with. And that's the reason why we try to prepare um, all the communities to deal with all types of hazards. Anytime you might deal with um, people that are, um, you know, not happy with government or whatever, they might have all kinds of different sources, chemical, biological, radiological. Um, so it could be other things besides just explosions or, you know, building collapses. Participants found the various challenges that could take place in a biological or chemical threat requires organization, communication, and cooperation from all regional authorities. I think this is a lot more realistic than anything that I've ever been through. Um, they have everything set up as it would be if we had this kind of situation at Baltimore, at Camden Yards. Everyone has their own duties. My thoughts are everyone should go through it. Uh, it is definitely an eye opener. I feel safer going back to Baltimore and knowing that I've experienced it. And if there is an incident, I am able to put a suit on properly and uh, secure it and protect myself as well as being able to help others. We've been doing a lot of great initiatives and a lot of great work that um, I definitely look forward to taking back to my hospital. The Center for Domestic Preparedness provides training that is federally funded and is of no cost to state, local, and tribal emergency response professionals of their agency. If you would like to register for CDP courses, visit their website at cdp.dhs.gov.